That sure does look good there, Teresa. In a world of smartphones, tablets, game consoles, Pokemon Go, all that fun stuff, it's hard to get good upload speeds all at the same time, but the reality is most families only have one internet connection, so how do you make it all work? Here with the answer, we called in our buddy Joe Ferriolo. He is the area general manager for Frontier. Welcome back, Joe. Hey, Ryan. Good to see you again. Good to see you. We're talking all about fiber optics. What is it, and how does it help? Well, first, fiber optics is the future, and the good news is the future is now. Mm -hmm. So fiber optics is a, uh, is a gla glass or plastic line that we use to deliver internet traffic and video in our phone uh, to the home. So, so it's right different in, from copper. It's different right. from copper. So today, traditionally, whether it's coax cable from the cable companies or the, the copper lines from, our, uh, from Frontier, mm -hmm. they're capable and limited in terms of what they deliver. We are now bringing fiber to the home, which means that we will deliver a fiber line into every residence. And that's now capable of delivering faster speeds up to 1,000 meg or one gig of wow. speed. Which is significantly higher than what it is now. Because when you think about it, families, when, when you log on and, and somebody's playing PlayStation uh, and, and the kids on Pokemon Go and the mom's on the laptop, everything starts to slow down. So, so that's the end of this. Yeah, and that, that's called buffering, right? And a lot of times what happens is, is you've got a certain amount of bandwidth coming into the house that are a certain amount of speed and everybody wants to take advantage of it. So when everybody's using it, it slows down and then it lags. So you'll be streaming Netflix and then all of a sudden it'll start to freeze and, and, and then you start hearing yelling from the other room saying, what are you doing, get off the internet. Mm -hmm. So this now will allow us to deliver an incredible experience to our customers, more speed than they'll ever know what to do with yeah. and be able to stream multiple devices without the lag time and, and without the issues. And the nice thing about it is it's not susceptible to, to weather or electromagnetic fields. It's really, you know, allows us to be able to deliver a seamless, high value, high powered entertainment system to a customer. And they can stream CT style online at WDTNH.com. There you go. They'll be watching repeats of the segment right here. So, so <laughs> what's the, the install process like? So the install process is no different than anything else, except for the line coming to the house now will be replaced with a fiber line that we'll bring into the home as opposed to the copper line that currently exists. Mm -hmm. And we're in the process of deploying this throughout the state of Connecticut. We're doing it at an initial rollout. Uh, going to touch roughly 24,000 homes this year. Wow. And, and, and on pace to start to double that and triple that as we go forward as we deploy it. So the good news is, is that the folks in Connecticut get to kind of tell us where they want it. Excellent. Um, so, you know, you'll be posting my email address here shortly, or they call the 1 800 Frontier uh, number and ask for the services. They're available now in limited areas. Very good. But certainly, by all means, let us know where you are. And if you get a neighborhood that wants to sign up, you get 20 or 30 of your neighbors. Contact us, let us know. We'll come out to see you next. Hold on, somebody's calling Joe. I'm, I'm going to take this call at Steve. Joe, thank you so much for joining us here today on the show. Thanks, Steve, Ryan. You're going to have to hold for one second because coming up here on the show, if you're in a